How much price could Bitcoin really go to? What's really got its potential? Well, let's have a look at the facts. Right now it's trading around $30,000 per Bitcoin. But many are saying it could go to potentially as much as $1.5 million per Bitcoin. Of course, that may have got your attention. What's behind it and what factors should we really consider? Okay, well, let's give you exact and give you answers to that. Well, first of all, how are people working out this price prediction? What factors are they taking on board? Well, if you look at the world and all the money that's invested in the world, there's 900 trillion invested in the world. So if you look at it, where do they invest? They buy stocks and shares. They invest into government bonds. Some people put their money in just a bank account and leave it there. So you look at all of that money. Will people buy Bitcoin? Well, of course, that's the question. But if we take the 900 trillion, and this is where the price prediction comes from, and just 1% of it goes into Bitcoin as an alternative, as an alternative to perhaps gold, as an alternative perhaps to the dollar, 1% would mean that each Bitcoin would be worth $500,000. Is it possible? Well, yes, it's possible. But where does the speculation come? What's the downside? Well, it's based on sentiment. It's supply and demand. In other words, if there's more demand for something, particularly Bitcoin, which has a limited amount of Bitcoins, it's limited by code to 21 million Bitcoins, then if there's more people buying than selling, because there's a limited amount, then it goes up. That's why some people consider it like gold. There's a limited supply. There's not easy to get. So therefore, people say, well, it's got similar properties. It's just easier to use. Larry Fink, who's the CEO of BlackRock, and they manage 10 trillion on their own, says that Bitcoin's got a place to play in the financial system. If you buy that, then of course, you'd think that Bitcoin could rise in price. What's the speculation? Well, it's supply and demand. So in other words, 21 million Bitcoin is the mass maximum amount. If more people are buying than selling, then the price goes up. It's as simple as that. Can it go to 500,000? Yes. Is there an alternative? No, not right now. So it has the potential. It has the name. It's been around for over 10 years, but it's still speculation. So if you're young and you're an investor, it's definitely something that you should, in my opinion, be looking at. Again, with me as an investor, I've been in the industry a long period of time as the CEO of the largest international advisory company in the world. Do I own Bitcoin? Yes, I do. Have I invested for a period of time? Yes, I have. However, let me give you the facts. It's a percentage of what I invest. In other words, it has potential. And if you follow me on my social media, you'll know that there are other things that have got potential. But for me, price prediction, 30,000 right now, it'll go to, I think, 50,000 by the end of the year. And it has potential to go much higher. But just remember, it's always some speculation. There's no guarantees in life. You have to realize that. But is it something that should grab your attention? For me, yes, absolutely. But ultimately, you should talk to an advisor. And I've given you the facts. You can share the video, of course, with other people. See what they think. I'll give you the facts. You need to make a decision or talk to an advisor to make that final decision for you.